Today I want to talk to you about another success tip. This one boils down to let your freak flag fly. Great Scott Marty! Yeah, if you're wondering where I'm going with this, go ahead and uh, keep watching. If not, you can always find more of my videos down on the video part somewhere. A lot of times here on YouTube, we all get caught up in what somebody else expects of us and or what we expect of ourselves. Sometimes you just have to do something for you. That means you gotta have a little bit of fun, maybe make a video just for yourself, maybe flex your creative muscles in a way that you normally wouldn't, just because it seems fun and just because it seems enjoyable to you. Maybe pull out a character you don't use often. Sometimes we can be our own worst critics. We can also kind of get caught in a funk of doing the same thing again and again and again, which isn't really good for anybody. No one wants to feel trapped in the kind of content that they do. Also, no one as viewer really wants to watch the same thing over and over and over again. Of course, people subscribe for a specific style. They subscribe for a certain type of either commentary or video. However, at the end of the day, people also want to see innovations happen. People also want to see you evolve over time. Also, sometimes just a fun or funny video that pops up by surprise can also be appreciated very much. Hi there! I'm a surprise! Nice to meet you with your little surprising goodies! <laughs> Often you can find yourself in a rut, you can find yourself just generating the content that other people are going to enjoy. However, remember, unless you're fortunate enough to do this as a full-time job, this is actually entertainment for not only your viewers, this is also entertainment for yourself. So sometimes letting go, even if it might seem childish or petty or outside your comfort zone, flex your creative muscles. Also, flex your personality, flex who you are. You know, let other people see another side of you. Even if it's just a one-off, get it off of your chest and let people enjoy the other side of you. Coming this summer, this is Anthony Smith. The most epic Anthony Smith ever devised by science. Sometimes by turning the camera on or filming, if you're, if you're a gamer and you're just filming Let's Play content, sometimes just filming and seeing what happens can be the best thing that you can do. Whether it be some silly song you start singing, making it up as you go, a story you start telling, um, it, as long as you are having fun, just record it. Find out if it's usable. Sometimes it's usable, sometimes it's not. You will never know unless you try. There are those people who will tell you to never stray from whatever vertical that you find yourself in, whether it be gaming or vlogging or politics or whatever. But I have to tell you right now, those people, they have a point and sometimes it's very relevant. However, other times, it really depends on whether you're entertaining yourself or the audience or both. Are they there just for gameplay, or are they there to subscribe to you and what you have to say? Are they there just for your vlogs, or would they also like to see a short film? Are they there for your political commentary, or would they possibly put up with a short skit, or maybe just a random rage vlog? Sometimes doing something just because can actually ignite a passion within yourself. You didn't even know it was there, or put you back on task so that you can continue working the way you were working previously. I am the Prince of Spain. You should all bow before me, for my greatness is too much for all of you, for you, and you, and you. I am Wait. awesome. Spain doesn't have a prince. Ah, yes, well, good sir. While you were questioning my identity, I was stealing your phone. <laughs> of course, there are extremes to just about anything. So do keep in mind that if you stray too far from your content, you do risk cheesing other people off. This advice doesn't necessarily mean that you should start a new series or do a one-off video. Sometimes it can be as much as just trying a new gag or a new skit or a new bit. Maybe just trying something you normally wouldn't just to keep the creative juices flowing and having fun. Because that's what we're all here to do, right? You kids today don't even know what fun is. Back in my day, the only fun we had was... What was I saying? Bah! I hope 
this video has been helpful for you. I hope it's given you something to think about. I hope maybe you cracked a smile during this. If you did, let us know in the comment section down below. I'm going to be looking for the word SMILE in all caps. So let us know. I'll be tracking it with the heartbeat extension just to see how many people I made smile. Till next time, I'm Anthony with the freedom. Like, subscribe, comment, please. Let's discover freedom. Click the first video to learn what is freedom and how it helps you grow. Click the second video to learn about sponsorships for all freedom partners, even if you have just 10 subscribers. And click the other videos like how do I leave freedom to learn more. Click get more views to learn how to build your audience faster on YouTube. Click get more CPM to learn how to make more money from your channel. And click get more music to learn where to get more music to spice up your videos. Click the first playlist to watch The George Show on Freedom. That's my show. Or watch The Anthony Show or The Alex Show also on Freedom.